Take a close look at your screen. Now the light you see there is the flashlight of an NOPD officer just moments before he shot a suspected robber. This is new video we just got our hands on tonight and the entire incident started when police say that suspect robbed two women who had just dropped their children off at church. Good evening everyone and thank you for joining us. I'm Sharice Gibson. Uh, the robbery happened outside of Church of God El Milagro on North Dorgenois and the Glofi Greenway. Uh, police say they found the suspect a block away on St. Louis Street. Our Mike McDaniel has been following that story for the last 24 hours. Mike is here with that exclusive video. Hey there, Sharice. Well, on the scene last night, we could see officers using flashlights searching around the Greenway for any evidence. Well, this video shows an officer using a flashlight as well. The difference here, though, is the officer was searching for a suspect and he found him. It's video that shows the moments a New Orleans police officer shoots an armed robbery suspect Tuesday night on the Lafitte Greenway. One of our officers was canvassing the area. While canvassing, you can see an officer with a flashlight searching bushes for the suspect. The flashlight falls to the ground, and you can see what appears to be multiple flashes from the officer's gun. He uh, exchanged gunfire within uh, a suspect at that point. In slow motion, you can count six shots. Backup officers quickly swarm the area, blocking off roads and putting folks who live around here on alert. Renee Simon was outside her home when she heard the shots and is tired of the violence. It's just getting out of control, out of hand, period. This video is the ending of what Chief Deputy Superintendent Christopher Goodley says started as a call for service at a church on North Dorgenwa. Through that call, it turned out to be they were investigating an armed robbery. According to our partners at NOLA.com, a man named Daniel Ignacio Mejia Castillo robbed two women, stealing one of their purses with a cell phone inside. Police say when someone called that cell phone, Mejia's hiding spot was found, leading to what we now see on video. That suspect has uh, sustained three gunshot wounds. He is actually uh, suffering from nine life-threatening uh, injuries. Chief Goodley says those gunshot wounds were to one of Mejia's legs. He was taken to the hospital and faces a list of charges, which as of Wednesday afternoon, police said they were still working on. The officer, a three-year veteran at NOPD, was not injured. Investigations are underway because of this shooting. The unidentified officer was wearing a body camera at the time, and that footage is now being reviewed by the NOPD. It is expected to be released sometime next week. Sharice. All right, thank you so much, Mike. We look forward to seeing that update.